Good afternoon. Afternoon. Kapaudu Medicine. Guys. Everyone, welcome to Double Up with the Tea Twins. My name is Matt Sidiso. My name is Sidiso. Oh, by the way, um, someone sent me a message saying that um, they want to do an intro for Double Up with the Tea Twins. Oh, is it? Yeah, but we do we have. We do have. We have <laughs> a very nice intro. It's just that we don't use it. Sometimes as I it feel like time. it takes it takes time and yeah. before someone could actually listen to the video, that intro becomes yeah. too long. It takes yeah. I don't know. But we'll see. Yeah. We'll see guys, maybe you guys now. should comment down below and tell us if we should put yeah, the intro, intro or couple not. but I fell out of it. Straight, straight to, to the, the point. point. <laughs> no, in now, now, you know, the reason why I decided to not use the intro is because even when I watch other people's videos, mm. you want to skip the intro? <laughs> skip the intro. <laughs> I always skip the intro. No, no, it's so, nice. It's yeah, nice introduction and all, but mm. hey, we're mm. always in the heart. Because even when I talk, I'm mm. straight to the point. I the intro. i to the point. I'm to the point. Yeah, hey. Okay. I've been thinking. You know what? We grew up being the two of us. We were this lovely kids from very, I think from birth. We have always been, um, we have always been catching people's attention. But because mm. we are twins and we were cute babies and we were beautiful kids like that. So, a lot of people used to love us. People used to be around us a lot. Um, I remember even growing up, there would be rich people or high-profile people who wanted to be around us. But I don't remember. Or oh, is it because or something like that? But I don't remember actually taking advantage of people who loved us or who showed interest in us. Hore. We can ask for money even today. It's, it's difficult to ask for money or to be so entitled hore, just because so and so likes me, they like to talk to me. Now I can just go and, and demand certain things from them. <laughs> yeah, hey. Yeah, that's true. Like a lot of people, like a lot of um, uh, people from like prominent families, yeah, like high profile people used to, yeah, they used to love us a lot because most of the time we'll be visiting this family, mm. you know. Mm. Our yeah. dad, if it didn't, yeah, I didn't like I, it. I didn't like it. Yeah. But even us, we used to associate with uh, those kind of people and the reason. Mm why we wanted to be associated with those people, to be friends with kids mm. from rich families, mm. to be friends with kids from um, high-profile families. Like, it was no interest just to, just to know how are these people living their lives, also to, to copy mm. their style, because we go back home, you know, in this family, this they is how do, they do this things. This is how they do things, yeah. and then we mm. advise our parents, maybe look at in you know, those kind of things. Mm. Hey, hey, yeah, also nice. the most <laughs> draw motivation. Motivation. Yeah. Mm. Remember, mom, yes, yeah, they were not rich, yeah, they were not, but. but they were so elegant. They were so elegant. Yeah. yeah. I used to love so how elegant and tidy. And so clean. And so, yeah. Because yeah. I remember their house. I, I, I actually got inside all this time. I thought in my head, it was like, <laughs> in my head, like, <laughs> <laughs> it was like their house. Go judging from the outside, the way it was so neat and everything. The yard. The yard. Yeah, it used to register as a big house. Yeah. Only to find out that it's only a three-roomed house. Mm. 
not three bedrooms, like three, three rooms. Three rooms, the kitchen, the kitchen, kitchen room, and the bedroom. Living room and the bedroom. Mm. And then the, their mom was a single mom. Yes. There's a single mom, Mama Khotatsu, then Khotatsu and Khotli. Yes. And this house is so, everything is it's put tidy. together. Even the clothes that Khotli used to wear. They're always ironed, the wearing... way she used to walk, yes. the way she used to mm. carry herself, herself. Mm. you know. That's okay. So like, I, I drew a you know, lot of class, you know, yeah. shouting, you know. So I will visit them. I will mm. always, I was just like a little puppy around her. Wherever she went, I was always <laughs> I running around whole. Yeah, I don't know, know what. Running all time. the time. Like uh, sometimes I, I become so sad that she passed away. And yeah. by the time she passed away, um, we were not really talking that much. Because yeah, she not, she got married. Yeah. And I somehow got disappointed that she got married. Because mm. it felt like she got married at a, a young, young age. age. Yeah, before reaching her potential. Yeah, exactly. And yeah, I, there are some people that you feel like, there's so many of them. Like, yeah. This, guy, this woman. And she where she got potential. married also. I, I had I had some questions. Like who I felt like, she got oh, married hey, to. Who she got <laughs> married to. So I lost interest yeah. by the time she got married to her. Yeah. She, she disappointed me. Yeah. <laughs> So uh, you were too entitled. Yeah, I was too entitled. I very yeah. much entitled, mm. and like because really I was a little puppy, mm. always running around. So yeah, now that that was the case. Always, oh, how yeah, about I was, yeah, yeah, how about Every time we were coming uh, back from the boarding school, the first place because they used to have some restaurant yeah. in town. We will go see them. Hi, how you doing? And yeah, we'll how sit they down do with things them and check because they were working for, for their, their parents, family, for family the business. business. Yeah. So we used to mm. love that way. They are not all over the place. Mm. Every mm. time they are inside this restaurant, they are really working. Mm. Yeah, they yeah. So employees. it was interesting. Well, yeah. these kids are employees and they are working here. Yeah. Mm. And then we go home. Our spell will just drive us home, and then. Um, at the same time, she will also be making another appointment to her. Ah, can you guys come and spend a weekend mm -hmm. with us? Yeah, yes. even uh, her mm. tiger, Shawela. Mm. Yeah, because you know that Shawela, there used to be oh. like a, a shopping center. Yes. And then I think uh, Tiger was owning that Mm. That place, the whole shopping the whole center, shopping and there were other people renting mm. out from him. So, so he was rich, mm. and his kids mm. used to love us. They will visit us. Mm. And these kids will just spend the whole the day. whole day. Sometimes it's hot. We just look at them and say, "You guys, <laughs> you, you've got such a nice house. It's a big house, but, but you guys come all and, all and sit here follow. with us in yeah. this lizang. Yeah. It's, it's, it's so hot." <laughs> <laughs> yeah, so we ended up being friends and then we would visit and check how they live their lives. Yes, Ask I, them a lot of a lot questions. Of questions. <laughs> how did your father start this business? This and this but and this. But you didn't and this. want to eat? <laughs> yeah, we were untidy. Eh? You didn't see all over the place. Wise men. Yeah. <laughs> and there was this guy who used to own a friend. Around. Yeah, he was also elegant, you know. They all they used to go to private schools. <laughs> and then, wise men. Wise men used to own the salon. Salon in yeah. Jamuel yeah. because there were people waking. waking. Mm. And he used to know his thing, yeah? Go to his he house. Was very ah, good. it's so good, man. No, no, no. I remember the other day when we were at Vets, <laughs> yeah. there was this guy called Tabso Malakwani. Yeah, yeah, yeah. He was from the Sotu. So mm. he was also from a very yeah, family. Yeah. He used to own Texas. Yeah, something yeah. Something like that. So Tabiso, he was a next door neighbor. They were wise men, mm. where wise men was coming mm. from, Shawel. Mm. So we'll always be able to say, you know, our friend, wise, wise men, this and this, our friend. Wise men, but you know. I don't know what you're doing. 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 And then he moved to a flat. Yeah. Where he was living alone. Yes, yes, yes. So Ratamali <laughs> now from come oh, in a the flat it was in uh, Protea. Protea, eh? yeah. So we we met at the salon because mm. the salon in Eli Shawel mm. we're driving and then he buys a two liter away in When we got there, all the cups, all the like everything was dead. Did you look at zinc? 
e tletse me hola na o ga o go bona gore thong longwe tshelwa ka mono ke boi sometimes you ask yourself hey, some no, questions it's not normal Untidy to the point that you ask yourself that I think this one is Sangoma said you no. must never no. ever like it's not this normal house. man no yes. man no guys so we, we used to love him yeah yeah man. he was a yeah because cool he was also elegant you know and our grandmother used to, to, to what is it that our grandmother used to say what about man him? yeah what man mm. yeah it's like I remember the other day a uh, wise man um we didn't want to hook up with him. Mm. And then we said, and I think we had a fight. Yeah, we had a we fight. We had a fight because we, we used to fight a lot <laughs> with him. And <laughs> uh, yeah, we're going to our grandmother's house. Da, 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 da. Then he called us. Mm. Then we asked, I said, don't, don't even think of coming here. And he said, I don't know where are you guys going to hide because I can just come with a tin you know, open and open, open that thing. <laughs> He was savage. You were savage. And you think you are hiding. Mm. No, that, 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 that was it. So mm. I remember so many people, so many people who wanted to be closer to us, even though bullet arts are, you know, they used to be very rich back then. Uh, but I don't remember taking advantage when, when we were in varsity and all of that, even when we started working, because everyone who was high profile or who was rich, our interest was to know what they are doing yeah what and they how do how did how they, do they get, get there? there yeah yeah how are they and how are they maintaining, maintaining it? it yeah but nowadays you come across this young kids sometimes like you don't even have much just because you are clean uh, you look presentable uh, they look at the area where you stay some will assume you are rich you know but the first thing they want to know about you let's say you get um maybe your your sister your younger sister's friends or the cousins that you didn't know uh so you just got in, introduced to them so now i got to realize i'm very worried because i feel like the list of kids who are expecting too much from us is growing